Well, good morning. This is Big Mo, the Crypto Lion, here with another tutorial about <clears throat> how to move this money around in this crypto market. All right, that was my Twitter page. Feel free to follow me. Uh, it's Island Crypto Group. All righty, on Bitrix. So what I'm going to show you is how to buy. I want to buy a couple of these smaller altcoins. Dogecoin, I've been seeing a lot of that on, on Twitter. And Sciacoin, um, I've been seeing a lot on that one as well. So I already bought some Sciacoin. So okay, first thing you do after you set up your account, log into Bitrix. And as you can see, I have a few different altcoins here. I have a little bit of Bitcoin. That's what we're going to use today. So I have some NEO. I don't even remember what XMR is. Um, of course, I can look it up. Uh, Power Ledger. I think that's going to do well. So I'm going to keep buying Power Ledger. The last time I looked, I think it was around 60 cents or 70 cents. All right, that's my little bit, bit of coin. I bought some of Doge last night. So I have 3,000 Doge coins last night. And I guess this is the Bitcoin gold that they... Uh, from the fork okay so the first thing you want to do is after you log in go to wallets all right and that's going to show you the page that we we're just on and that's going to show you all your balances the first thing you want to do no actually you don't want to do that if you have nothing there the first thing you want to do is search for BTC okay and I have hide zero balances so it doesn't show just a rack of stuff so if you uncheck it it just shows you I'm sorry, let's do that one more time. Yeah, it just shows you all these random coins. So what I prefer to do, like I said, is hide zero balances, put in BTC, and it shows me uh, my BTC balance. Now, if you don't have a balance, all you do is click this plus sign. Boop, 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 boop. All righty. Come on. Hit the plus sign. There we go. And it gives you the address. To deposit the Bitcoin so you can either scan the QR code or you can just highlight this address copy and then go into your wallet and paste it and do a send from your wallet so you would go into your wallet click click on make sure you're looking at BTC always double check what the what the bounces I think I have an empty jacks wallet here okay I do so you would click send you would put the address of where it's going paste and then the amount like so this this wallets is empty so you just hit that and you would send and then you would, it would show the transaction you just wait for the six confirmations to uh, so you would know that it's it's on its way alrighty so once you have some BTC let's get rid of that here's a couple of quick shortcuts so what we're gonna do today since I bought some doge uh, yesterday I'm gonna go ahead and just do Sciacoin. Now here's a couple of uh, little shortcuts you can use. So you're in Bitrix, you've already logged in, leave that window, open another window or another tab. Go over to coinmarketcap.com. All right, I'll do it so you can do it so you can see it. Do a search for the coin you're looking for, Sciacoin. Search. Okay, it comes up. So you see you verify it's Sciacoin, and there's its, uh, its ticker symbol, SC. And you see how much it's going for. It's going for under two cents. It's down, which is good because we're not worried about that. We're we're putting in, you know, investing into it for uh, for some appreciation. So we want to buy it cheap. So if you want to see what it's been doing, you go down and you look at the charts and so forth. But I've been following it, so I know where where it's been. Wow, I could have gotten it even cheaper yesterday, last night, I guess. You know, that's another thing, is uh, keep an eye on the markets in the middle of the night. For some reason, I don't know if it's, you know, and I know it's international, that's why I'm a little puzzled, but you'll notice, you'll see these dips, like when um, Bitcoin dips, it's in the middle of the night. It's 1 a.m., 2 a.m., so keep an eye on that. I mean, you could do a limit order, but that's another video. All right, so you've seen the charts, you looked at the charts, go over to markets, all right? Now, the first thing we do is we see the Bitrix pair. So this is showing you... The Sciacoin, how do I say it? The value of Sciacoin in Bitcoin. Now, you could also do it, the value of Sciacoin in Ethereum. And then it shows you all the markets. Well, this is only seven. This is a very small coin. Uh, this are all the places where you can buy it. So again, we've, logged, we've already logged into our Bitrix account. 
we came into coin market cap we did a search we found our side coin we clicked on markets and we see where it's being sold now there's some other tools here um, historical data tells you where the price has been social um, that connects you to all their networks at Twitter and all of that stuff um, but we're not we're not into that right at this moment the reddit links and so forth but let's stay focused so we're on markets so what you do you come down and since I have Bitcoin I'm going to click here so what it's going to do since I already uh, opened up Bitrix it's going to take me directly to the Sidecoin Bitrix market okay I don't have to search for it or anything it just pops it right in so what we'll do now is uh, again you, you, there's the chart now we're just gonna go buy some I'm not you know I'm not gonna too worry about the price so what I typically do is last let's see the bid is what it can sell for the ask is okay ask is what they're asking for if I'm not mistaken yeah yeah the, it's the higher of the two prices so this is what it's going for all right now if you want to know what that is just to keep track we just copy that. We'll go back out to our calculator on coin market cap. Put that price in. And Bitcoin. Okay, so that's that's the price. It's under two cents USD. 0 0.018. So you round up. Alright. Okay, so let's go back over here to our side coin. So that's what it's going for. Now you can see kind of where it's been just by looking in the order book. Now, you know, if you're not really familiar, then it looks like, oh my God, what is all of this? But it just gives you a gauge. Just look at the last part of it, 138. Okay, look at the 138. So you can look and see where the price is. So you see they're all the way from 128 to 136, 137, 138, 39. So we're somewhere in between. So we should have no problem. Uh, getting this order filled. So I have uh, in the Bitcoin wallet, in the Bitrix wallet, I think it's like $18 or something. Again, you just copy it, put out, go to the cryptocurrency converter calculator, and it'll tell you exactly how much that is. But I already know it's around $18 or so. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit max. It tells you right here how much BTC you have available. So I'm going to hit max. And that's going to give me almost a thousand side coin, 950. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to click buy. And it just says, you know, check everything. It tells you how much your total is going to be. And you can click this number here, put in the calculator, verify again your price. Excuse me, how much that is. But I already looked. I think it said it's around 18 bucks. I'm going to hit confirm. Boom. Buy placed. And the buy is filled. Okay, so because we put it in between the bid and the ask, um, it, it took it right away. The other alternative is you can click one of these, one of the asks, and it'll pop that order right in with the price. So, okay, so it's not open, okay, because you saw it fill. And then here's our order history. So right here, it shows, wait a minute, why is it a sell? Oh, 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 this is, I thought this was our, okay, here it is, my order history. Limit by 950 side coin, and how much we paid for, we paid 136, so we actually got a little cheaper, and it tells you exactly how much it cost us. And again, if you're not sure, you can just highlight this, pop it in the crypto converter, uh, converter and you'll know exactly what to do. All right, so let's go up back to our balances. All right, do a little refresh. Because I had 2078. So let's do a refresh. And it'll show our balances here. Oh, I guess I could have done this as well. And there we go. 3029. So it's 2078 plus, what was that, 900 or something we got, or 800? So now we're at 3029 at uh, just under two cents a piece. Okay? And then when you're all done, just log out. Make sure that you're in here and you have your uh, two-factor authentication set up in Bitrix because I don't know that there's any wallets for any of these except for Bitcoin and Bitcoin Gold. So that's why I store these on Bitrix. Um, 
If anyone is familiar with a wallet where you can store these other coins, please let me know so that I can uh, I can pull them off and, and uh, save them in my wallet. Alrighty, that's it for now. Big Mo, uh, please like and subscribe or dislike and still subscribe. <laughs> uh, appreciate you. See you in the next video.